All right, so today we got a special guest all the way from Jacksonville, Florida. Unfortunately, it's cold out here. 36 degrees, it sucks, cold. Mr. Mike himself from Mike's Woodshop from YouTube right here, famous YouTuber right here. Mike's Woodshop, the best tools, unboxing and walkthroughs, and he's a brat brother, and he's a nitro brother. This guy's the man for Milwaukee's and Fest tools and all types of stuff, man. What's going uh, on? Here's the, this is the man right here. <laughs> I found him on YouTube about a year or so ago when I got back into the one-fifth scale. And this guy is the king. <laughs> he is the king of one-fifth scale. Any questions? No questions. No questions. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not the king, but... Oh, yes. you are. Zach. You are. And the coffee. King of and the Zach coffees. <laughs> and the Zach. coffee. Salud. Salud. Yeah. I like the Very good. Mr. Mike liked the Very Zach good. coffee. Very good. So now, I, I had to come down. I had to come and visit my old <laughs> people I knew, but I had to come down and visit John. Mr. Mike, yeah, he visited everybody here in Long Island. Oh, he went to track their hobbies. He went everywhere. Look at this picture here. So, Mr. Mike right here, super good guy, super hard worker, and he's here for a family wedding up in Long Island, so he decided to take a visit. But uh, since Mr. Mike is here, I, uh, I, was, I really wasn't going to film today, all right? I got a lot of stuff to do. I, have to, I actually have to go back to work. I got probably going to work till 10 p.m. tonight, who knows? But uh, That's why you guys, <laughs> when you hear him, you, quiet and all, the family's sleeping, he's up at 2 in the morning. Yeah, it's pretty much uh, only late at night I, I have time to do things. But, uh, well, we have, let's, since Mr. Mike is here, let's take advantage of it. We have a lot of stuff to do. There's things that I haven't unboxed in over a year. Uh, your choice. Oh, I also got a new pipe. I got a new special pipe from Bartolone for the new Roven oh, Max T. Still in a box. Uh, but before we, we, we choose, uh, I'm going to let you choose. We can, we have Tom Pit Dog Hydro unboxing still. We got some Nitro Engines unboxing. And we have uh, Bartolone Pipe to unbox. And we have Roven Goodies to unbox. So you decide. You pick one. Pick one or two. We can do probably two unboxings today. If we had time. He unfortunately has to go back. He's, he's got the wedding this weekend. Then he has to go back to Jacksonville, Florida. Because he's, he's a freaking working man. He's got projects there but if he had more time we'd go out we go to my buddy's portuguese restaurant and we chow down you know we, next time you get oh, you gotta I'm, come for more time next I'm time i'm back at a whole week in july oh awesome awesome maybe a july we'll go there we'll, hit, we'll go hit some portuguese uh, style steaks or, or seafood That's whatever you want great. but let's 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 bring mr mike over to the garage my garage is a mess so sorry sorry about that but Let's show him a few things. Have you seen the Primal Monster truck yet? No. Oh, no, no. That? Let's I get his reaction. Let's get that. Way. Downstairs first. I, I got to feed my truck. Fish. Which truck? The, the Primal. Oh, one. the Primal, yeah. I love Monster. Oh, my God. Look <laughs> at this place. There's, there's Senior. Yeah, there's Senior. When I raced quarter scale, that's what I read. My race was Senior's car. Look at this place. Oh my god. Look at the engines. I got three the engines. Three I got. And one's in the car. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the oh my god. John man. I, guys, you, you just can't you can't even imagine what this place is like until you you're here. I mean, just you know, look at look at this the the, the king. The king right He's there. The, the king right yep. here. That's his glove right there too. Yes, I know, I know, man. Oh, look at this! Oh my God! <laughs> Sorry for the mess, man. I got. No, no, no. It's fine. Don't worry about it. You gotta see. I mean, my garage right now is a mess. But here's the shorty. Yeah. 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 That's the shorty. Yeah, she, the shorty is fun. Bunch of bodies. The old Kong ties. Remember those wheels? Yeah. Truckzilla's, the Nitro uh, yep. Savage yeah. conversions. Yeah. That's the DBXL, right, body? <clears throat> no, those are uh, 30 degree north. Those are oh, all 5T okay. bodies and X2. Yeah, it looks like it, right? That's yeah. The, the third one in is from Roven. I actually really like it. 
Oh, yeah. um, that one ran. The right track there. that I was racing the. Um, I got more shit to do and forget about. The track that I was racing the Afna yeah. with the open wheel. Yeah. He started selling. Afna. Yeah, he started <laughs> selling the Baja right. with the conversion kit, with the foam wheels. I'm he was kidding. gonna make his track bigger because he was 390 feet. But he needed about 500 feet to race the oh, one yeah. fifth. Mm -hmm. But he's a land clearer, mm -hmm. and he just—he's mm -hmm. matter of fact, the track's for sale, and it was—and oh. it's like so close to my house. Oh but, man! Oh, well, now I'm yeah. just in the dirt. You could have had that made. That yeah. would have been oh, nice. It would have been beautiful. <clears throat> it would have been. Beautiful. I was trying to convince what's his face from Track Day Hobby to come down. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. He would like it there. To come down. Look at this. There it is. Oh, we got it. We got. We got some modified engines, nitro engines, two one box, still. And since we're here, let's see what we got here. Right. So, here, let's, let's see. All right, so this, I was going to do a video of this together with something else, but these are some goodies from Primal RC and Roven. All right, so what we got here is, I had just some, a little ideas, a few ideas that I had. What we got here is, is the brake cables for the Primal Monster Truck. They're like freaking bicycle freaking yeah, cables. The, yeah, they're they monster. are. So, I want to do... Look at these brakes. Beautiful. Part numbers. Okay? Now, this here... I, I'm going to try to do front brakes on my Roven Baja Max T. Which is the longer, bigger wider Baja, right? There's no brake systems made for that. It's too wide. So, what if we don't use these brake cables? You see how it's much smaller? Yeah. We don't use this. We use the Primal Monster Truck brake cables instead of those, and then try to make it work. I was, I was going to try that project. Oh, shit, we got a wheelie bar, too. That's the dual wheel. Nice. That, that Baja Max T is super fun. It's nice, man. I love that thing, man, really. But it need, for me to jump and have fun with that, unfortunately, it's not four-wheel drive. But, man, that thing does wonders with two-wheel drive. But it needs the front brakes. When I'm up in the air, man, I need, I need those big wheels to at least stop. To at least stop to nosedive it. Because otherwise, the Bajas, once you go like that, that's it. It's ass heavy. It's going gonna, it's gonna to land on its ass all the time, most of the time. But so I, I want to try to figure out a way to do front brakes on that Max T. We cannot use Baja brake kits, so we got to make it work. So I'm going to try to make it work with the Primal Monster Truck brake cables. We'll see what happens. What we got here is an all new uh, wheelie bar. I've never seen this before. This is from Roven, all new, brand new. Now I have other wheelie bars. Let's see. We've got other wheelie bars here. There it is, right there. And these are heavy duty, man. We can put this on the back. Right there, these here. This is a heavy duty. You can, This is like a, a roll cage in itself. This right here will protect the rear exhaust pipes. But I've never seen a dual wheel one like that. I got my Barcelona hats over here. Falling all over the place. <clears throat> yeah, that, that right there. Yo, and it's got a rear bumper, I like it. So this here may protect those rear exhaust pipes, man. Yeah, look at that part number for you guys in case you guys want it. Very cool. But yeah, that's fucking metal right here, man. That's strong. So and if I'm jumping, way. man, this right here, for the guys that like those rear exhaust systems, for that pipe, this right here should protect it. Should protect it, man. It's got dual wheel instead of the single. So that, that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, look at that. It's like a whole rear cage. I like I like that. <clears throat> Alright, so what we got here? King motor. Alright, so I got some uh, in the future I'm gonna do a few I'm gonna do a future video of King Motor RC only. I actually have some bad news for everybody that I, I just found out. Alright, so this is a whole nother video I will bring up. I hate bringing up bad news, but Stay tuned. I'm going to bring up a little topic of that. I also have other topics. We still have to talk about Robin from ERCM. All right. That's a whole nother video. And what we got here? And this here, I got to show everybody right here. Let's open this up. All right. What we got here is 
Super important for all you Roven 45cc engine owners. You must use these exhaust gaskets. Here's the part number. I'm gonna hold it here for a bit. Stock up on these. The good thing is they give you a few. Look at that. Part number once again. 45cc engine owners, you need these gaskets, people. Stock up on them. They are not the same as any other gaskets. They are different. All right. Now, I need this because my exhaust was loose and I burnt it. All right. So it went to shit. And, but we got good news. We got a, a new exhaust system for it made. So stay tuned for that. Yeah. Those are, oh, those are the shocks, man. They, oh, those, those shocks are called happy to see you, Mike. Happy to see you. <laughs> Oh my God. Yeah, I may use that on a future project with that Baja I'm about to show you upstairs. That's it. We got that, uh, the Gizmo 30.5. Yeah, we yeah. got the stock G290, the 29 CY. Yeah. Well, got two speeds here. Got a bunch of goodies everywhere, pretty much. Is this your, um, got some from the drag stuff? Yeah, it's from the accident. That's man. from the, yeah. It went right through that That's freaking went, barricade. Yeah. yeah. Oh my God. And you were so calm. I would, <laughs> I, I would have been crying. You were so calm when that it happened. That fucking thing, man. I had so many different types of fucking front ends. All right. Expensive. Like, I, yeah, had, yeah, I went through yeah. a bunch of front ends, and uh, the stock is best for it's me. Even the carbon fiber, everything. Yeah. Wow. That sound bitch went through right through that. Yeah, I gotta one day go over a bunch of stuff. I have a bunch of goodies here. Steering setup system. Look at that. From Rogan. Just one day I gotta go over everything. I got some special wheels here. Hopefully, find these are in it. What do we got here? Oh, yeah. These are the custom ones. All right, I don't, who knows? They'll be out next year. But you feel that? Oh, wow. But uh, it's yeah. a, it's it's slightly um, it's not as tall either, so it's, that messes around with the gearing a bit. So I have to trial and error. But that compound is a special compound. But that was when Bishop was in business, so I don't know what the new owners are gonna do. You know, right now I hear they're having some issues, but hopefully they'll get their shit together. But at least I got. It. Now, this is the um, oh, so this is the, the chassis, right? This, for the yeah, the beautiful. You have to see this, you have to see this before you go. This is RC Max, Mike Taylor made this chassis oh to play. God. Isn't that sweet, man? Look at the CNC, it's fucking I mean, it's amazing. Perfect, perfect. Yeah, that's a beauty. It's a work of art. You man. just can't, you just can't picture over the video what this thing really looks yeah. like. This is oh my god, yeah, yeah, yeah. everything. So no joke. Really nice, and it's, it's really not, it's not heavy at all. Not heavy at all. One, I want to do a nice, take my time, do a nice little build. I got a bunch of parts over there now. There's also other companies that are stepping up to the plate. Gap Racing, super goodies. Gap Racing, man, you got to give them, you got to give credit when credit is due. You know what I'm saying? Look at the beautiful diffs, diff cases. You know. Heavy duty yeah. Some piece of metal. Look at these bad boys, man. Feel that. Wow. This is heavy duty dog rooms. This is for, what is this for? I just hope that MTXL. This is for the yeah. MTXL? Never ever been available Damn. until now. Did, did when the, the fucking thing's discontinued. Can you believe, can you make this shit up? You can't. You can't make this shit up. MTXL is discontinued. But now you have all the goodies. It's like, yeah, yeah, you build yeah. your own or... Well, but, you can. With all the parts. Well, only the next level piece, guys are going to... This is some piece of metal. It is, man. That's sweet. I know. That's super. I don't know. But, wow. Uh, yeah, so a bunch of stuff. <clears throat> you ever see the SCZ engine? It's like... Remember the... Yep. It's a good motor right there. Different. I like different shit. It's a five, five bolt. Really? Yeah. Really nice. Very mm -hmm. nice. That's my next project. Is I want to build an engine from scratch. 
want to build one from scratch. You can get uh, some nice, um, you can get a, a, a beautiful Bartolone crankcase. Mm -hmm. You can either do a reed case or, or a piston port. <clears throat> and then start from there. You know, Bartolone has like the nicest crank crankcases, man. I was there in person, man. I've seen it. Yes, I I've seen these crankcases. Uh, He's got beautiful crankcases, man. I saw your uh, vacation slash oh, yeah. visit Bartolone. Yeah, pretty. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, wifey, let's go check out California. I really want to, I just want to go to California and hang out with Chris, man. We don't get out. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> you want to see a, a work of art engine? And what we got here is a RC Max, kid. Wait till you see the size of this fucking clutch. It's crazy. <laughs> it's fucking. It's like stronger than my motorcycle's clutch. I'm not kidding, man. Titanium pipe. Look at this titanium. I, oh my Look at that beauty. There's like no weight to it. Now you're gonna have this um, coated. Uh, yeah, I'm probably gonna get a ceramic coated because it's gonna be hot as hell. But yeah. well, I, I'd hate to do that to a, a work of art like that. But I mean, it is gorgeous. Just to keep that heat. On this thing alone. Mr. Mike, you want to see a beast? Look at this baby right here. Oh. That's the, the king right there of big boars. 80 Supreme. That's the 80 Supreme. RC Max 80 Supreme. <clears throat> I wish I had my... Uh, oh. I wish I had my Bartolone 50 and 40 engine here, but he's still working on it. Look Wait till you, that's a beauty as well. But dude. Look at that. That shit is oh ridiculous. Oh my God. Man. This shit's crazy. Look at that fucking, that, the clutch setup is like the size of yeah. some people's heads. Look at this. Yeah. Look at a pull start. Yeah. Yeah, this shit is serious. That is a work of art. I'm gonna, 80. 80? Yeah. Oh, my yeah. eyes. Wow. Well, I'm not even going to ask you what you're going to do because I don't want you to reveal where this is going to go. <laughs> yeah. I want it to be a surprise. Yeah, I a, mean, this thing's a monster. That's a monster, yeah. It's going to probably just break shit apart, but it's just a work of art, man. I had to have it. Look at that. Look at that clutch. That shit's ridiculous. Wow. Yeah. I, I still, I can't believe it. I still can't believe it. Beautiful. I mean, it's beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Stand I built uh, from the rigid. <laughs> Mr. Mike says now that he sees the stand, now he's gonna purchase it. I'm telling you, Mr. Mike, this stand is a, is a yeah. It, you work like a gentleman with this for real. Yeah, now it is. I have a, I have a many stands. I have some ones that I made myself. I, there's some ones that I've hooped it up. There's some ones that that were cheaper at the time, like the dynamite ones. The dynamite one I found, I was actually. <laughs> there's no comparison to this on, on eBay. But then yeah. I'm like, forget yeah, it. Yeah. I like it. So if I'm going to buy it, I'm going to buy yeah. the rocket. There's you no know. comparison, yeah. I just, you know, with yeah. between the this Baja a, and the, yeah. the DBXL. This is the Baja plate. You know, I also fit my, you can put a longer nut in the bottom, uh, bolt, like this. To extend and, this out more. Yeah, extend yeah. it out more. Then you can put your Primal Monster truck. I'm sorry, your Primal Dragster. If you had the Dragster, oh, okay. you can fit the Dragster here as well. He also has the plate for the MTXL coming out real soon. I'll be showing that. Here's one for the X2 and 5Ts and... Okay, yeah. Sorry for that. But yeah, I've done already a, a good amount of projects here. Yeah. I'm gonna probably get another one. That way I can carry it, bring it in my truck. I mean, that's how much I like it. And then you, you, know, you can fold it, fold it away. I like it. Uh, a husky 72 inch with the back. Mm -hmm. But with the wood shop, you know, that takes up everything. Yeah. I just want that this thing in. Instead of having me yeah. roll it around, yeah. just cover it, put it in a corner, forget I like the how I like the way how you're so well organized and neat. And I'm like, one day we got to hang out, man. I've always liked your, your videos. When you, I'm like, oh man, I wish Mr. Mike was over here. We would be neighbors. Because he, he, he Mr. Mike here, everybody should go to his channel, check him out, man. I mean, if you like tools and stuff like that, you gotta go. But he also braps, he's got brap videos, he's got a Baja, he's got some old, old past Nitro stuff, so check him out, check him out on, it's Mike's Woodshop. All right, I'm gonna put your link on my, under my video here, under uh, the description. Unfortunately, I do like the E-word. What? <laughs> oh, that's it. 
<laughs> That's Sorry, it. John. <laughs> hey, man, you got two E's up there. <laughs> Check out this engine, Mr. Mike. There's another work of art. Oh, that's the one the, I. That, the, that's the, also titanium, but I had a ceramic coated. The pipes are just amazing. They're yeah. just amazing. This I had ceramic coated by that guy. Yeah, I yeah, yeah Long Island. Yeah. And there's another work of art here. Yeah. It's like it's. This is the port forty six from RC Max as well. Yeah. Yeah, you. I think you didn't you show this yeah, one before? Yeah. 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 This is the one I ha I got delivered to track their hobbies, so my wife wouldn't know about it. <laughs> But she wound up, she wound up, she's like, what the hell? I mean, the workmanship is just unbelievable. Yeah, sweet. Yeah. They really, they have some good CNC machinery. Wow. Yeah. Mike Taylor and that John from Detroit Performance, they're a good team. They're a good team together. Put it at that. I would have been, I would have drove from Florida to go pick it up. He's I anxious. He wants amazing. to see the Primal Monster truck. Oh. He's like... I actually have to head back to work too. Unfortunately, man. Shit, man. We gotta, we gotta hang out. Better. No, man. no, no. We need, we need a couple I'll, of glasses of red wine. We'll be back. I'll be back I in July a, for a whole week. Oh man, some Mavum brandy, all that. Oh, Next time, we'll come down. We'll, we'll make a day. Nice. We'll nice. make a day when you're not working. And good luck with over a hundred thousand <laughs> subscribers. Thank you, man. And, well, um, maybe that'll still be here. That, that's from Tom Pit Dog I draw. I, I haven't unboxed that. It's probably been here over a year now. It'll probably still be here the next time you come back to New York. That's what I'll, I'll, we'll, we'll unbox that together. A lot of stuff you right. have for you, over a year. Yeah. You'll, you'll have to use the axe. Let's go <laughs> check out the primal. I'm watching these truckies race. Wow, this is your, your friend made these, huh? Well, he's a sponsor of my channel called Z Tools. Z Tools. Z Tools. Uh -huh. And basically what he has done is he has 3D printed. Let me grab mm -hmm. the other one. Which one you got? Okay. He's 3D printed tool and battery holders for everything okay. except Ryobi. So this mm -hmm. would take an 18 volt uh, Milwaukee battery. Yeah, it looks like it. Mount it. Let's get it, let's way. get it. I have it right here. Yeah. I got Milwaukee batteries in my kitchen, brother. <laughs> actually, let's use this guy here. Oh yeah, I, you can actually use both of them. I even got my wife using it. I have, my wife uses the Milwaukee backpack back there. Oh, no kidding, really? I got it. Quarter one. <laughs> So here. Oh, very cool, yeah, yeah. So that's how you mount it, nice. either like that, yeah, yeah. or like this. Mm -hmm. Now it's not lockable, but if you sh just remove the battery right out, and then this, let's grab that a second. I, I have just a drill say outside. this is your drill. I have the drill there if you want to. Just uh -huh. say if this is your drill, yeah. that will oh, now hold cool. the drill, Yeah, yeah. any impact, a saw, mm -hmm. whatever, mm -hmm. and, 18 volt. 18 volt. He oh. also has them for 12 volt. Oh, really? And he ha yep. He oh, I got it. I got to get it. For 12 volt. Because I got 12 volt stuff for uh, for my RCs yep. downstairs. The, I should have showed you my toolbox better downstairs. Yep. The um, 12 volt is lockable, but mm. he's his own company, and it's called Z Tools. Awesome. And if you tell him you saw it on Mike's Wood Shop, you get a 10 percent discount. Awesome. I'm gonna have to get those 12 volts from from Z Tools. You got two sets in there. Because I can just hang it on my my tool my my yeah. bench you see even reinforces nice for the for the drills oh yeah right. i have i have three of these on my mm -hmm. truck just not even counting mike's mm -hmm. wood shop and i have 17 in my truck Holy for batteries shit. wow just underneath all the shelves and yeah. we just come like gentlemen right like gentlemen, like gentlemen. Like gentlemen. take them out put wow. them back in they wow, work gonna, great I, I can probably get hundreds of those for my job i gotta i gotta we gotta talk to them so what we got here is a special exhaust but we, we unfortunately we're not gonna have time to go over this this is a whole nother thing stay tuned we finally have it people all you roving 45 cc engine owners we got the right correct exhaust for you people bro your 45 cc rovins will spank that ass you need this exhaust let's go what we got here these are my uh drills here Oh, you see it already? I didn't, oh, I didn't it's wanna... like a kid's toy. <laughs> it's like a it's kid's like, quad, right? It's almost as big as your, <laughs> your toy's quad. Let me put the oh lights on here. Oh my god! <laughs> Damn, man, I hate it. It's getting dark. It's cold out. I'm gonna have to open this freaking garage, man. I gotta put this shit together tomorrow. In my my daughter's room. I'm I'm it's, I'm always busy here. I got fig trees to put away. <clears throat> 
crazy busy, brother. Watch your, watch your knee here. My spikes on my oh arm. Look at that sound, bitch. Oh my god. It, it's, it is. <laughs> oh my. It is not even. You, it, nothing. <laughs> you can't even picture how big this thing is. I can't, right? You can't. I mean, I remember buying for my kids that those little four-wheel drive trucks from like Toys R Us. <laughs> it's the, that's what the size is. That's the best <laughs> way to explain it. It's massive. The power wheels, right? Power wheels, yeah. It's like the power wheels. Yeah, you go, you plug it in, add the acid battery, you plug it in, 30 hours of charge. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, John, you're going to make me buy this Dude, thing it's now. a work of art. I wish, if we had more room, man, I thought we had more time, I'd take the body. You got to see this in person yeah. under the hood. It's a freaking work of art, bro. Oh my God. The, 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 the job they did, the, the, all the aluminum, the, the machining is beautiful. All the anodized parts is beautiful, seriously. Bro, I beat the shit out of this thing, Mike. It's a, <laughs> try to try to try to try to pick it up. Got some weight. Just it's be careful. Got, it's a just. It's <laughs> you have to gorgeous. see these 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 axles. These look at this. Yeah. Holy shit! That's heavy. <laughs> Watch this. Look at this. Look at this thing. Yeah. But Mike, I've I've launched this thing. This thing has been up nine feet up in the air, time after time after time, many times already. But look at this. Yeah, look at this. Her, beautiful. I mean, they, they really put a lot of effort into this thing. There's the, the shock that you yeah. see downstairs. The sway bars, everything. Wow. Happy to see you. Happy to see you, Ken. Really nice. And then the roll cage was m my idea. I, I, I'm like, yo, you have to do a two-piece roll cage. Unfortunately, the price went up a little bit more. But for what you're getting, the, it's a great price for what you're getting. This, is, this mm -hmm. would have been crazy price if it was any other company. I mean, this thing is... Four feet. Per, per, almost four <laughs> feet tall. You know, standing up. Four yeah. feet tall. <laughs> you don't need, a, you don't need a, a stand for this. You can just... No. You ain't fitting that on that rocket stand. <laughs> no rocket stand. That, that thing will go... Oh. Yeah. You need an ATV stand for this thing. But you know what's going to... You, you know what kind of... <laughs> you see the transmission, Mr. Mike? Yeah, I, Look I at see that. that. Look at that. God knows what other companies they these, have to market are going to make ones. for this thing. Look at these drive shafts. I know. He's at... I mean, it, they're just, it's like three quarter inch, it's like three quarter inch copper. Yeah. Yeah. It's just, it's just unbelievable. Tires are massive. Yeah. I got a loose bolt. Look at this. Yeah. Dude, I've been driving the shit out of this thing. Not, not even on video. Like jump after jump after jump. It starts up so damn easy. But I still haven't uh, adjusted my uh, reverse cable. I got to do that. Now, wow. what we got here is the new Baja Max T. What a fun, what a fun monster. Yeah. It's, wow. it's, it handles great. It uh, does everything, man. It, you, it has this freaking stock engine runs great. Runs great. It does not overheat at all. I don't know why people bring that up. I mean, I have not overheated it yet. And I didn't even clog up this engine with debris like I did my... Look behind you, Mr. Mike. That's a freaking Baja 5B right here. Oh, yeah. yeah <clears throat> with yeah, the yeah, same yeah. engine. That thing I got clogged up with dirt. It's still dirt up in there. No no uh, out of wears, which I will be doing out of wears. But that thing went through a lot. A lot of grass stuff stuck up in the head. <clears throat> but this is what happened here. Now I got the... Now we got That's the, what the gaskets. Yeah, the gaskets, the gaskets for you. But now I'm going to have to remove this. I wanted to do a, another run with this. And jump it off my ramp, but I don't know if I'm gonna have time. I gotta put that. That's the first Bartolone exhaust ever for this engine. He made three exhausts. That's the one that he did some flow tests or some shit that worked the best. So whatever that is, is what we're gonna try out here. But it's never been on this here. He had it on a, a Baja there. He said it should work, but we're gonna test it out on here. See if everything lines up good. Because this engine is taller, a quarter inch difference from the bolts. So we got to line everything. So if it fits here good, that pipe I have to send back to Bartolone. And he's going to make a shitload for, for customers. But yeah, this is a fun beast right here. Very nice. I like the anodized red. Yeah, it's beautiful, right? Yeah, Sweet. It's very nice. Everything. Look at and then you look at the whole, even the steering plate here, yeah. the new steering Yeah, setup. I see this. I saw that. I saw and the, underneath it, it's full of aluminum. All the, all the, the linkage yeah, is yeah, push yeah, and pull. Yeah, yeah, 
But it's re- basically I had to replace the all shaft. of it. So Did you see the shock shaft? Yeah, I see that. It's fucking Big ridiculous. Difference. Yeah. Huge. This, these shock shafts are even thicker than the Primal Monster truck ones. Look at these things, wrenches. So my, my future idea is remove these rear shocks, install them in the front, and put the Primal Monster truck shocks on the back. And then even... It's pretty wide. This some bitch is wide, right? Yeah, very but, wide. Yeah. It, it's very wide. Wow. Yeah. I mean, it's got to be a third, at least a third yeah. wide. Yeah. Yeah, video don't do justice. Yeah. But I was going to even make it even wider. You know, I was going to do the, the, the Primal MT shocks, the Max-T rear shocks up front, and put the hub extenders, and turn this into like some crazy-ass looking weirded truggy. Those arms are sweet. Yeah. Well, you could actually make it into a NASCAR. Yeah. Yeah, no, there's so many things you could do with the Baja. Forget it. This on-road, off-road. Yeah. Drag, drag, Baja, all types of... This is really nice. Yeah. It is. It's sweet. It's super fun. And then there's my on-road. My, my dad tipped it over. My dad came here the other day. He sat over here, smoked his cigar... Man, you would love to hang out with my dad. He's constantly smoking cigars and sipping away at brandies and stuff. <laughs> he sat over here on top of my tool chest. This is a tool chest. Uh, I want to do a... Oh, man, too bad we didn't, We would do a... Wait a minute, that's, that's, that's the Harbor Freight tool the chest. The Harbor one, one that I sent you that, the pictures That of. you yeah. sent me the pictures of. That, that, that's that, it. That is like one of the best toolboxes yeah. for, for the price. For, uh, yeah, for the price. And yeah. I was going to make an RC toolbox video. Yeah. I haven't done it yet, but... Man, we should have done that together, but we, I have to head back to work. Right. That worked great. This is another great RC here, the, the Roven um, F5. Super heavy duty, man. This thing, I crashed the shit out of this fucking thing. I may even make one in the future for off-road, man. This thing is sweet. This thing is sweet. <clears throat> but I still have to go over this. Oh, my God. But, yeah, man. So, I, my garage, obviously, you can see it's full of stuff. I, I used to be able to work on my bench here. I used to be able to... You know, I've installed engines and transmissions here in, in, in cars. Here's my hoist on the beam. Here's my hoist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pull. I'm, but anyways. And then there's the dragster. You've seen... Still in... Uh, Waiting to be repaired. Yeah. Went right through that damn barricade. Yeah. Like a... Like a missile. <laughs> like a missile. <laughs> Oh man, that's it, Mr. Mike. Yeah. Well, I would have never been that calm. You like you into chainsaws at all? What's that? You like chainsaws? You're into chainsaws at all? Yeah, yeah. I, you know, we. You remember McCulloch's? Yeah. Check it out. Look at that beast up there. Oh my God! Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, sir. I love, I love, the, but unfortunately, I can't get damn parts for it. It's hard to get stuff for that. Yeah. There's got to be somebody, somebody online. That's how that's got I need a coil for that. If anybody knows out there, I need a coil for that. I can get it fired up. That thing sounds evil, that engine. But, um, I mean, it, it is crazy, man. I My ears pop. Uh, but, um, once it's hot, the, you can't restart it because the coils get hot. I got to take a picture of this. Guy. This, uh, I... Uh, John, uh, you may be getting a, a, a <laughs> Mr. Mike that I bought it. <laughs> Mr. Mike still can't believe it. I'll fi- I think I may find a place for it. But... <laughs> Holy shit! The problem, that that's you, you know you know I got the I'm into the uh, uh, Tamiya semis construction yeah. trucks yeah. and then cross. So mm-hmm. I have a spare bedroom upstairs that it's they're all on the dresses so. You get a guest come home. At least sure. they can sleep on the bed, but the dresser's got everything on it. The yeah. end table's yeah. got stuff on it for me. The cross or <laughs> Tamaya. I mean, this thing, uh, maybe, I guess I have to sleep in the shed. <laughs> wow. Yeah, Unbelievable, thing is sweet, John. Man. Unbelievable. I still got the ramp out there. I see. I saw that. I drove by before, and I saw the ramp. I saw the ramp. <laughs> Mr. Mike already went to Atlas Strength, everything, man. He's like, <laughs> yeah. Did you see Patrick there or no? No, no, nobody no, was there. Nobody was there, nobody was there but, you know. <laughs> you got to come with more time, man. We'll do some... Uh... <laughs> Atlas Strength. I got yeah, you yeah. the sticker back there. Yeah. Oh, wow. Well, John, it was a pleasure. Yeah, pleasure, man.
Thanks for stopping by, well, bro. Well, hey, it's just no crazy. problem, man. Keep up those great videos. I, I love those it. videos, man. <laughs> you learn a lot, man. You learn a lot. Just remember, any questions? No questions. <laughs> any questions? Look at this. Before Mr. Mike goes home, we're gonna give him a Botticelli fig tree right here. See this? I wanna. We we're gonna save this fig tree. We're gonna get this fig tree out of the cold to the beautiful Florida heat weather. There you go, kid. Thanks, Sean. <laughs> we got to see an update on that. Look at it. I think it's probably like eight inches. <laughs> Take care, man. It was a pleasure.